Okay, in this problem, we're told to apply definition one uh, to find the Laplace transform of f of t equals e to the t times sine of 2t. So the Laplace transform by definition is the integral from 0 to infinity of e to the negative st times our function f of t. So we can just plug that in. So we get e to the negative st times e to the t times sine of 2t. We could simplify this term a little bit. We can add the exponents together under one base of e. So we get So we, uh, so we want to find the integral from 0 to infinity of e to the t times quantity 1 minus s times sine of 2t. Now if we look in the back of the book, we can look at the integral table and we see that the integral from, or the integral of e to the au sine of du is equal to e to the au over a squared plus b squared all times the quantity a times sine of bu minus b times cosine of bu. So if we look at our equation, we have e to the t, oh, and this is all dt. And this is du. So if you replace the u's with t's, you'll see that our 1 minus s is our a term. And 2 is our B term. So we can just plug in. And we're going to evaluate it from 0 to infinity. So we see that we get um, e to the 1 minus quantity 1 minus s times t over the quantity 1 minus s squared plus 4, all times 1 minus s times sine of 2t minus 2 cosine 2t. And we're evaluating it from t equals 0 to infinity. So we look at this term and we see that the whole series will convert, or that the integral will converge if s is more than 1. So that's a, that's a, a requirement. We want s to be more than 1. And then if t is going to infinity, e to the negative, e to some negative value at times infinity, or as it goes to infinity, as e goes to negative infinity, is going to 0. 
So we see that the first term is going to be 0. So we see that this is equal to 0 minus. And then we can evaluate all of these terms at t equals 0. So we see that e to the 0 is 1. Sine of 0 is 0, so this first term is going to be 0. Cosine of 0 is 1, so we get minus 2. And we're just going to multiply these together. Negative 2 times negative 1 is 2, all over 1 minus s squared plus 4. So the Laplace transform of f of t is 2 over 1 minus s squared plus 4.